Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He is a karate black belt. He represents Georgie's gym in the Gold Coast, Australia. He has two wins, two losses. One of his wins by way of KO. Introducing Nasi Fulham. <laughs> and his opponent fighting out of the red corner is the current cruiserweight New Zealand and Travis Tasman came in the ring. He has 45 wins, two losses, with 25 big wins coming by way of KO. Representing City Kickboxing, ladies and gentlemen, presenting Israel the Skybreaker Adesanya! Five minutes to the ring, please, for Clyde Kelly's instructions. Commands at all times, protect yourselves at all times. Uh, no elbows. And a couple of you come to get in, just try and work, work out it. Step back, have a good fight. He is supremely confident. He's certainly a showman in the ring, but thus far in his career, he's been able to back it up. Nasi Fawai. Well, this is an opportunity for him to make a name for himself. Adesanya. A lack of fanfare for him. And we're underway. Adesanya out of the red corner. The fluorescent VDK print on his shorts. Switches to Southport. Spearing teeth from the left leg. He's heavy on the leg kicks. Good eyes, Adesanya. Fawai going with the spinning hook kick. Adesanya, though, saw it early. And that is a highlight kick. Anything you can do, I can do three times better. And we're only 20 seconds in the round. Adesanya spearing him with the jab. Heavy leg kick. They're calling for him to pressure Adesanya and cut the gap, bridge the gap. Adesanya, southpaw jab. Inside thigh kick, heavy kick taken there. For White lands his first one. He's very, very fast with his legs. Hasn't really used his hands yet. For White reacting to just about every fake. Big knee there. Catches him on the end of a right hand. Adesanya gets himself off the ropes, back out into centre ring. Fawai, a compact fighter. Adesanya shuffling to his right, coming back with the spearing jab. Fawai looking for that right hand. Adesanya not having a lot of problem landing it. Chopping right hand from Fawai. That one landed. Got his attention. He cannot afford to muck around. Adesanya picking him off at relative ease. Big body shot from Adesanya. Quick enough to pretty much throw single shots and pick him off at will. Uh, Desanya with spinning hook kick. We've seen him be a lot more brutal than this in the past, but he's just picking his shots, taking his time. Fawai, he's been very solid. He did land a good right hand, but that's been it so far. the first round, dominant from Adesanya, 10-8 with the jumping, spinning, round kick, knockdown. We did see though, he is human, he can be hit. He was clipped by a right hand coming off the clinch. And it is highlight reel stuff. Just clubbed him down, 
for the what's known as a spinning round kick inside the first 20 seconds many people would go an entire career wanting to land that once Adesanya lands it with ease and with regularity no hurry in the corner no hurry in the corner whatsoever the single shots are working so the game plan is minimizing the risks and picking him off breaking him down slowly Adesanya clearly the lightest man in the field he'll have to make the 90 kilo limit on Monday evening at Super 8 starting off at Southpaw once again for White looking for the inside kick Adesanya landing that right hand shuffles his leg back making for I miss Counted nicely for White. Adesanya is just getting him to react to pretty much every fake. The knee or the uppercut will be coming at some point soon. Spinning back kick for White. Showing that he has some speed and agility himself. Left knee there. Sonia had time to pick himself up off the ground and get out of the way. Talking to him now. This is why we love Adesanya so much, or some hate him, but undoubtedly he's an entertainer. Fawai looking for that counter inside kick every time he's touched. It's worked well for him. Very tight guard. And once again, every time he's touched, he's looking to return with a kick. Keeping those gloves very tight. Combos, brother. Combos, come on. Adesanya, at this point, just picking him off with the single shots using his speed. This is with the spinning back kick. Dismiss him for wise corner. Once again, just imperious. He's hurt him badly now. Thirty seconds to go, and this is the second round of our fourth and final quarterfinal. Israel Adesanya putting on a clinic. Crowds enjoying it. Nasef Wai probably less so. He's reacting to everything. Israel trying to pull that right glove forward so he can land the kick. Body shot with the right hand. For White looking to land that inside kick. Does it well, but takes the right hand for his trouble. Hands up, hands up. Hands up. Hands up. Well, there's no question who run the round. It's certainly entertaining. Adesanya taking a pretty risk-free approach. He's not throwing too much caution to the wind. For White showing he's tough, Monty, but uh, not a heck of a lot coming in return. No, that's right. He's tried the best he can with the high knee there by Israel Adesanya. Just one of the many sort of displays or varieties of attack that he has. It really is a treat watching this kid fight. We've been treated to a real clinic in terms of a display that you don't normally see. His vision, his reflexes, his movement in the air. It really is great to watch. But I wonder if he can go on with this mentality, not fully committing, knowing that the next fight is against Dan Roberts. Well, they're calling for numbers from Nazi Fawai, but the problem is you can't hit what you can't touch. 
He's working his leg kicks well. He'd do well to second phase off those leg kicks with punches. And that might open up Adesanya. He's certainly tough, White. Also, the other thing, Monty, I, I guess, too, is the power that Adesanya possesses at cruiserweight, up another 10 kilos, it's certainly different. Adesanya's showboating right to the end. His, his faking is beautiful to watch. Fawai, though, is keeping his hands very high, and he needs to. That's that spearing MMA-style front kick. Looking for the front kick, going with the spinning back kick. It's hard to keep up. It's just a joy to watch from the commentary position. Looking for the, the knee. Uppercut there. Left hook there. Landed, but caught him over the air. Oh, he's brutalized his face. He's been put through a meat grinder. Broken nose. Adesanya just picking him off. He's tough though for White. Looking for the hand trap where he pulls the gloves down to open up the chin. And there we saw, almost on cue, he's tough for White, looking for the, the big shot, but the hands are high. So Israel Adesanya takes the knee. Doctor's been called in, and the towel has been thrown in. We didn't see that. It's all. Brave performance from Nasi Fawai. I've been sprayed by his blood ringside. Monty Beatham's toweling himself off there's Founder of Duco, Dave Higgins. He's got a show coming up, Fight for Life. December the 5th, of course. This Tuesday the 3rd on Sky Sport 1, there's the Super 8 as well. And right here we've just seen a superb, superb semi-final ahead of us. The favourite Dan Roberts will go up against Israel Adesanya as we head to Lieutenant Dan for the official decision. Fighters to the centre ring please. Fighters to the center ring, please. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, at one minute and 29 seconds into round three, we have a corner retirement. Therefore, your winner by TKO, putting it in the red corner, is Real the Star. Sign!